In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how the animated headline works in Elementor Pro, all its settings, all its features, and we're getting started right now. Hey, what is going on? My name is Bjorn. If you like WordPress tips and tricks and always getting better at it, make sure you click subscribe, then the bell notification icon so you don't miss anything. And this video is part of the Elementor Pro playlist in this channel link in the description down below or part of the comments down below. Make sure you check out the whole playlist to see all the widgets in action. And if you haven't done so yet, make sure you get on the Elementor Pro Ultimate Course waitlist, which I'm building right now. I'm still in the process of building it. It's not completed yet. Getting on the waitlist is no obligation. But if you do like Elementor and you want to know how to do everything with it, get on that waitlist. Link in the description down below. And with that out of the way, let's hit in the screen capture. I'll see you there. It's going to copy our headline like I always do and paste it down below. And now we're gonna do animated headline element. This is a pretty simple element, not too many settings going on, but we have the ability to create animated headlines, which are amazing, as this headline says. So this says, this page is amazing, and if you saw what happened when this loaded, it's gonna happen again. The amazing is circled in that yellow circle. Now to change the text of the, high, of the highlighting, you change the text before right here. So you could say, hello, comma, and then have, my name is, and then after, I have Bjorn. If I could spell my own name, that'd be great. So maybe my name is not the right thing to circle, but uh, you get the idea. You can have text before, highlight a text right here, and then text after. You can also change the shape of the highlighting. First, I'm gonna change the color of it so we can see it better. So let's change the color of the shape by going to style and let's make it red. Who doesn't like a good old red highlight? Now we can really see it. So we have circle, we have curly, underline, double, double underline, underline, zigzag, diagonal, strike through and X. And as you can see, a number of those, the diagonal strike through and X, they're actually behind the words. So you can have it like that, but if you want them in front, you have to go to style and then choose bring to front. And that will put them or put the highlighting on the front of the word. You can give it rounded edges. You can slightly see a slight change on the edges when I, when I select this. So that's rounding the edges instead of having flat edges. Rounding makes it look like more like a, a pen or a pencil actually did it. Other options we have here, we can align, center, give it a heading tag. I like to give it a background just because it's a headline. So let's just give it a this element a background. I'm going to, let's see, put this lady back there. Let's give it a height min height of 400, maybe a little more like that. I want to have it not repeated. So I go to style, repeat, no repeat. And I want it to cover and stretch full width. I want the image to cover. So I've got the cover in there. And now this white or the dark gray text doesn't look quite right. So I'm gonna make that text white. Ends up being a lot of white text on this page here. Text color for the headline to white. Text color for the animated portion also to white. That looks a lot better. And now we have an animated headline. Other animations, this one's called highlighted. There's also rotating, which rotates through text. So instead of having the animated text that we saw there, we have it rotate. So um, let's see. That tree is big, tall, strong, and get rid of the after. So now this tree that I'm referring to in the background here is big and then tall and then strong. So it can rotate through words that you enter here. And again, you have a text before, text after. Under style, we can change the animated text typography and the headline typography just like before. And those are the two types of animated headlines. 
the style settings are pretty basic and the advanced settings are the same as every other one. So that's how it works. I hope this video helps you. If you haven't done so yet, make sure you click subscribe, then the bell notification icon so you don't miss anything. And also consider buying Elementor through the affiliate link down below. It doesn't cost you any more to purchase it that way, but Elementor does send me a few dollars commission, which helps me keep these glorious lights on. And if you do purchase through there, thank you very much. And next up was clicking one of these videos that popped up on the right hand side so you can get even better at WordPress. And until next time, keep crushing it and I will see you in the next video.